Etisalat makes official switch to 9 Mobile. In a bid to rebrand the face of the company and improve on its services, Etisalat Nigeria has changed its name to 9 Mobile. This comes in the wake of the takeover of the multinational brand. Check out moments from the press conference where the name change was officially announced. Our new name and brand is not a product of circumstance or chance. Rather, it's a deliberate representation and confirmation of our Oito Niger heritage, our Niger centricity, and our evolution over nine years. Um, for those who don't know, this is our ninth year in existence, so there's a big connotation with that for us. We have in that period made, I'm sure all of you will agree, very positive contributions towards the telecom sector in Nigeria. We will continue to make even more positive contributions post this. So what assurance do we have in specific terms that your more than 21 million subscribers will continue to enjoy the same top-notch quality? And then number two, what is the situation with the bank loans? Those two questions. We put this to test, a little test, and a very rigorous one in the period of time that we had. And what gave us the joy to share this with the public and members of press, friends of press, is the fact that we've seen results from the test we've done so far, underscoring certain elements in favor of the new identity, which gives us the confidence that what we have is better than what we had. In the previous presentations, nothing is changing. We are only wearing a new look, a new identity, and we are going forward. It's the same person. I mean, somebody goes to school, comes out of school, changes his name. You don't tell him to go back and change his certificate. It's still the same person. So nothing is changing. If anything is changing at all, it's to change, even to make things better. Our name change does not change what we stand for. We've always stood for innovativeness, youthfulness, diversity, a, a, a vibrant brand. That stays because the brand is dependent on one thing, people. Nigeria has actually come of age when it comes to this industry. And I'm not disappointed that we stick to the brand with the Nigeria flavor. <laughs> and uh, having said that, I want to ask a simple question. Uh, now that this branding or branding, What's the timeline for us to phase out the old brand? Thank you. Mine is a simple question. Point of congratulations again. Uh, do you see Nine Mobile as a transition name? That's a gap name. Or, or when a new investor, like institution comes into Nine Mobile, <laughs> can I change the name? This company is about the people running it. As of today, there is one member of staff, I think, that seconded from um, the, the, our, our previous partners, and that member of staff has actually accepted a local contract. So all the services that you're getting today are run, operated, managed, and maintained by the same team that exists here today, local people. There is currently no service that is being run with the support and help from anybody outside of the shores of this country. So the departure of any partner has absolutely no bearing on the quality of service that you will continue to get. Nine Mobile is basically a, 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 a drawdown from our history, our heritage, things we've done in the past. It originates from our original, our first set of numbers, which were 0809. We've run campaigns around 0809, 080 Niger. We're in our ninth year of existence. So there's a big resonance for us. Nine also symbolizes youthfulness, and that's what we stand for. It's, a, it's an ongoing exercise. I, I must reiterate again, nothing has changed in terms of what we stand for. So all you are going to see are those properties that we owned before will now be run as Nine Mobile. So we will be exactly what we were to the youth market, which we've always been interested in, which has always driven our way of life and our way of operating as a business.